What's up guys, it's iWarcraft, I love saying that, and welcome to my first PvP video since returning to the channel, and my first PvP video in Star Wars The Old Republic. Today we have some low level PvP, this video was actually taken before the episode 1 of the Star Wars The Old Republic vlog. Um, these PvP videos are going to be separate from the vlog, so just be aware of that. But yeah! Some low level PvP on Void Star with a commando, level 10 commando trooper, and I had a blast, guys. I honestly had a blast. It, it's nice being able to go into a war zone at level 10 and be able to do a lot of damage and, you know, be scaled with everybody else so you're not at a huge disadvantage. While you don't have the amount of abilities that maybe a level 40 does, you still are able to fight against a level 40 re relatively equally. Um, and, and I feel like I have a ton of abilities. I don't know if every class has this amount of abilities at level 10, but I feel like I have a ton. So I didn't feel at too much of a disadvantage. I felt I did quite well in this war zone and honestly had a lot of fun. So first of all, again, this is my very first PvP video on my commando. It may have been, I think it was my second war zone on my commando, maybe even my first. I'm not sure. But I'm still getting, I'm still struggling to get used to a, a rotation that deals the most DPS. I'm working on that. I haven't really looked one up. I enjoy doing things on my own. So I'm going to come up with a, a good rotation. But in this battleground, or in this war zone rather, I was just trying to do as much damage as possible. I was trying to kite my enemies. I was trying to stay alive. I was trying to attempt to find the healers. And just do what I'm supposed to do as a commando, as a trooper. Just shoot, shoot away, stay outside the fray, don't dive into the middle of a fight. Kite enemies if they do happen to get on me and just slowly take down enemies from a range distance. So I am no pro with the trooper class yet. With the abilities, with even my role. Because in World of Warcraft I played a hunter and that's kind of how... You know, I've been playing this trooper kind of like I would play a hunter and I think that's what I'm supposed to do But I'm not entirely sure because troopers have heavy ammo and a lot of health So or not heavy ammo heavy heavy armor and a lot of health So there may be a different way to play the trooper. I'm not sure yet. I'll work it out as time goes on guys again I'm not a professional um, I've been in Star Wars The Old Republic for about two weeks now So this was all brand new to me, but I really did have a blast one thing, another thing, actually, you know, there's the abilities and learning my class, but there's learning other classes as well. That is one thing I have found I am struggling greatly with. Uh, Star Wars The Old Republic is a very new game to me, and I don't know every single class in the game and what they do. I don't even know what the names of every class in the game are and how many classes even exist. I really don't. So, for me in PvP... In World of Warcraft, I could pick out a healer. I could pick out a priest or a holy pally or or even a, you know, resto druid or or a shaman healer or or a monk healer. I could pick those out very easily. And I even got to the point where I knew their weaknesses and knew their strengths. In Star Wars The Old Republic, that has been a completely different ball game for me. I don't know who a healer is or what to look for when I'm trying to find a healer. Um, I don't know what certain classes do, what their strengths and weaknesses are. And as a ranged as a ranged character, I kind of have to know that. I have to know exactly who to pick out in a fight to take down to help my team. And I'm working on that. I, I try to pick out the guys kind of on the outside of the fight when I can. Because generally that's where a healer is going to be standing. They're not going to be battling it out in the freaking gauntlet of warrior type classes. They're going to be standing outside healing those warrior type classes. So I do have to work on that. I don't know if the symbols above people's names. I, I'm guessing that represents their class. But I, again, I don't have the classes memorized yet. But I am going to work on that. And I am going to improve my PvP skills in Star Wars The Old Republic. But guys, I just had a blast with this. It brought me back to doing my first couple battlegrounds as a hunter back in World of Warcraft. And, and getting better with my hunter and learning the ins and, out, uh, ins and outs of the hunter and it was super fun so hopefully you enjoyed this video if you want to hate on it go ahead again i'm not a pro at, at trooper yet at commando yet i'm learning it i'm having fun 
and this was a blast. Uh, we did end up winning this war zone, and I have been leveling up pretty quickly from war zones and getting the currency and everything, so that's also nice. Gonna try to get some PvP gear, not really sure where to get it, or if I still can get it at low level, but I'm going to try to get it. Hopefully you enjoyed this video, guys. I will have more episodes of the vlog and more PvP videos coming soon, but that's all for today. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace!